It's not brand new, but it's still new enough to those of us from American press outlets. The concept of a high-end Samsung smartphone that actually feels high-end. I'm Michael Fisher with Pocket Now, and this is a quick hands-on of the Samsung Galaxy Alpha. Okay, so the Galaxy Alpha doesn't go crazy on specs. It's got a 720p display, a less than 2,000 milliamp hour battery, and 32 gigs of storage with no micro SD card. But unlike most of the company's other premium smartphones, this one isn't made to set the spec sheet on fire. It's made to feel great in the hand. And uh, it really does, like a lot. It's not just the metal frame that helps the Alpha stand out, though it certainly helps with those sharp beveled edges. And the cool to the touch material is much more satisfying than the typical chrome plated plastic. Just as important, it's the size that makes the phone so compelling. The Super AMOLED display is only 4.7 inches, and as a result, the whole thing is much easier to manage with one hand. With the new color palette and fine finish, even that dimpled texturing on the back looks good. Er, at least better than it does on the S5. Elsewhere, the specs fall in line with Samsung's 2014 high-enders. Fingerprint scanner, 12 megapixel camera, Exynos Okta, heart rate scanner, and so on. You know the rest. And the software is the typical touch whiz, with all the ups and downs that carries. To be honest, the software isn't attractive enough to live up to the hardware, which is something we don't often find ourselves saying about Samsung devices. So while it seems like a backhanded compliment, it's the truth. Samsung has crafted something beautiful with the Galaxy Alpha, and if this is a sign of things to come, there's lots to be excited about, presuming the software catches up. There's much more to come from Samsung and everyone else at IFA 2014 in Berlin, so stay tuned for much more as our coverage continues. Till next time, this has been Michael Fisher with Pocket Now with Taylor Martin behind the camera. See you on the next one.